<laughs> hey, arrabbiata in Italian means angry because we are about to use one spicy sauce. Now, cooking in Italy is different. Uh, it's known for great spices, of course, but it's the proper blend that makes the difference. It just depends on how angry you really are. Joining us now is Master Chef Giuliano Hassan, and uh, uh, you're not really angry at all, are you? No, no. Actually, today, this is a sauce that's going to be hot and passionate, not ah, angry. Love We're it. going to heat things up a little bit. Okay. Actually, not that many Italian sauces are spicy, but some are, and this is one of them. This and is a great Valentine's it's Day a great Valentine's dinner dish. to spice things up and get ready for Valentine's evening, if you know what I mean. That's right. Mm -hmm. So we're going to start by sauteing some pancetta and garlic. Okay. This is some chopped garlic. Now, and what is making it spicy is a little bit of hot red pepper. This is, you say, pancetta. 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 Yes, I'm going to show you what it looks like. Is that a right ham here. product, a pork product? It is like bacon. Okay. It's important to use mm -hmm. a good quality one because mm -hmm. it's different from bacon. It's cured. It's okay. not smoked. I see. You see, if I open it up like this, uh -huh. you oh, can yeah. see. Oh, boy. It looks just like bacon. That's going to be full of flavor. You know that. That's right. Okay. okay. So, I'm going to put you to work here. Already you smells good. Just keep moving that around. I'm going to add okay. some fresh tomatoes. Okay. And we're going to add a little oh, bit of look salt. Oh, that. Oh, ho, ho. Okay. You can already Where? smell it in here, folks. Ah, yes. You see, this is from my new book, 30-Minute Pasta, and okay. it takes less than the time it takes to boil the water and cook the pasta. Really? So you don't have to spend a lot of time doing this. It you can spend a very, more time eating it. With pasta your... is a very inexpensive dish. It's so much fun. It's so filling and fulfilling. It's great. Now, these tomatoes uh, were peeled. I'm going to show you what I call my peeling trick. Okay. You see, instead of dragging a peeler across like that, right. which is difficult, right. I go back and forth in a sawing motion. Oh, how about that? You see, and that cuts now, through the skin Why do you really want to peel easily. the tomato? Just, because just... otherwise you just have skin floating around okay, in there. Okay, which you really and don't that's want. that's not very good. Okay, well, but let's you see, take we, that out of there. Yeah, but we don't need this dish because this okay. uh, this pot, this cooks for about 10 or 12 minutes, mm -hmm. and, and then you've we're going to swap it out. it down to that. Yep, to this, over okay. here. So and then when it's cooked down like this, this is mm -hmm. when I'm going to add some basil. I chop okay. it right at the last minute and put it in. Okay, that makes and it very fresh by make, putting it in the last fresh, minute fragrance, mm -hmm. and then a little bit of extra virgin olive oil at the end. Okay. And this oh. dish is done. We're going to... Seriously, that's here. it? Yes. Oh, and this all, is great. You know, all it took that we didn't do was about 12, 15 minutes at the most. Fantastic. Of cooking over there. I'm going to turn this off. Okay, we still got a couple minutes to go, so let's dish this okay. up. So, this is the pasta. You wouldn't mm -hmm. do this at home, of course. And You'd boil it and right. drain it. Right. But and this, this is I a, had it ready, a, so it'd be hot. This is penne. Penne, uh -huh. penne yes. Penne pasta. Penne in Italian means quills or pens. Okay. And you see, they look a little bit like quills. And then we're going to put our sauce in. And I guess we're going to mix, mix that up a little bit. Can I yes. use the same? I can use the same uh, utensil. You can, can I absolutely. Not? And that. so you see, it coats the pasta oh, nicely. Look at that. You never want to rinse the pasta because otherwise you why is get that? A, you wash away that coating of starch, and that's what allows the sauce to cling to it. Okay. You see how the pasta is taking the color. See, I've heard if you don't sauce, rinse the pasta, then the pasta sticks together. No, 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 it doesn't stick together. It'll unless, of course, it's, you don't toss it with the sauce. Kind of making a mess here. I think you're doing great. I'm going to put <laughs> some on the dish over here. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going to serve a that. little bit for it because you might be hungry by now. Darn right, I'm hungry. Yes, after all that cooking. After smelling this, is here fantastic. You go. Now, uh, do we have any uh, cheese or anything to put on this? Oh, you, we you have could cheese. Certainly, grate some cheese. Yeah. I would think on this. This is some pecorino cheese. Okay. This is sheep's milk cheese. You see, since this sheep's is, milk, this is a slightly spicy. Sauce. Okay. So instead of parmigiano, which is a cow's milk cheese, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. we're going to do pecorino, which is a sheep's milk cheese. Okay. It's a little bit spicier. It, so it's going to be even spicier. A little okay. bit. All right. Yeah. Very it's, good. It's 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 hot. I have let's to. Say. I, uh, all right. It's hot. Okay. Let's taste this. Now all the dishes that I do in my book, I always do with fresh tomatoes because mm. I really want that fresh flavor in mm, them. I'm telling and you. And they cook quickly because I do them in skillets. That like is this. fresh. That is very very fresh. Chef Giuliano's recipes, by the way, you can go to our website. DaytimeOnline.tv. Thank you very much, Chef Giuliani, for being here. Thank you Giuliano, for having me. We do appreciate it. Uh, it's always good to see you here. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir, and happy Valentine's Day. Happy to you. Valentine's Day. All right, stick around, folks. More daytime right after this. Mm, this is so good.